Right. There are a number of communities where Muslim immigrants have added to the lifeblood of communities that really needed um, more individuals. They needed a younger population. There's a wonderful film that uh, our website talks about, The Letter, um, a community in Maine that had its ups and downs with immigrants, uh, Muslim immigrants from Somalia. But what people find there in Maine, in Garden City, in, in other communities, is that these immigrants come in, they have families, they have young children, they uh, re-inspire and repopulate the, um, the elementary school population. Um, there are more soccer games, there are kids around, there are uh, young adults who are running mom and pop stores, working in the factories. You need people who are able-bodied and who want to be a part of a community and, and that is what these refugees want. This is, this is what immigrants want, peace and quiet and a community that is not one in which they have to be afraid for themselves uh, and for their children's welfare. And I think that what we've seen in Garden City and other communities like that is that people work together and each side learns to appreciate what the other has to offer. So um, I, I hope that will continue.